Getty Jean Claude Juncker, Recep Tayyip Erdogan and Donald Tusk The meeting is a follow-up to a summit in Varna, Bulgaria, where Mr. Erdogan met European Commission President Jean-Claude Juncker and European Council President Donald Tusk. The Varna summit was seen as a step to normalize relations between Ankara and the EU, which have nosedived over Mr. Erdogan's dismantling of Turkey's democratic institutions in the wake of an attempted coup. In 2016, recent military assaults on Kurdish forces in Syria and fiery rhetoric about the EU and the anti Turkish terrorists he accuses Germany and others of harboring have done little to improve the situation. Getty President Recep Tayyip Erdogan's growing dominance is worrying EU leaders. I, myself, Guarantee that Turkey's EU accession talks will continue Jean-Claude Juncker Brussels insiders EU leaders fear Ankara has become more of a long-term problem than a potential partner with some, including Austria's right-wing Chancellor Sebastian Kurz, demanding the immediate end of accession talks. But visa liberalization for Turkish nationals in the EU's borderless Schengen zone was a central plank of the EU-Turkey refugee deal signed at the height of the European migrant crisis in March 2016. Brussels and Ankara reached an agreement to take stricter measures against human traffickers, discourage irregular migration over the Aegean Sea and improve the conditions of Syrian refugees in Turkey. Getty the three leaders met to discuss improving relations between Turkey and the EU but under the deal. The EU has to provide a second payout of £2.63 billion to help Turkey manage its refugee population of about 3.5 million and agree to the acceleration of Ankara's controversial EU membership process. Mr. Erdogan said Turkey hopes to have left this difficult period in its relations with the European Union behind and stressed it would be a big mistake to leave Turkey out of the EU's enlargement process. Mr. Juncker said he was against the simple superficial idea of cutting Turkey's accession negotiations to the EU. Getty Austrian Chancellor Sebastian Kurz has demanded end to Turkish accession talks he said, I, myself, guarantee that Turkey's EU accession talks will continue. Mr. Tusk said no concrete solutions or compromises were reached in the EU-Turkey summit, but that he hopes to make this possible in the future. The next regular EU enlargement package is due this month when progress being made by EU candidate countries, including Turkey, is discussed by officials.